Kiara. Um, when we were kids, so her father, me, like we were all building friends. He literally acted it for you. Uh -huh. Rajkumar Santoshi ji, excellent actor. You just watch him, you're like, if I can do this, I'm already, it's yeah. already my work is done. And you do not intentionally make mistakes. Uh -huh. So it's okay to make mistakes. That's why pencils have erasers. I remember doing four, five shifts in one day. And you know, four, four hours here, three hours here, two hours here. Pulled and pushed everywhere, doing your makeup in the car. Hello everyone, this is Aina and welcome to Prinkula. I have three amazing powerhouse ladies with me today, Juhi Chawla, Aisha Julka and Tanuja ma'am. Welcome to Prinkula. Thank you, Aina. I want to start off uh, directly by asking that, uh, you know, the trailer starts with Juhi ma'am saying that don't do any work that you have regret or you have to get angry. So, do you have the same logo and motto in life that you don't want to do anything that you regret or you learn from your mistakes? How do you look at life? Well, yeah, I mean, it's impossible to have a life that is without mistakes. <laughs> so, yeah. <laughs> so I do think that, uh, I mean, the, the I think the idea of a perfect life or a perfect, some, a perfect anything is really where all pain begins. Because there is going to be pain, there is going to be hurt, there are going to be hurdles, there, there are going to be mistakes. So actually with the dialogue, by the way, was, that we uh, teach in childhood that don't do such a work that you have to do such a work. So, so then it's, she had gone on to say that but maybe I didn't learn this thing. If you teach it, then which one will you learn? Yeah, that's true. How many times our parents say that we don't do this, we don't do this. Unfortunately, human race is such that we do not want to learn from others' experiences. Yeah. We always have to experience it ourselves to yeah. realize that what we were told was right. Hmm. Yeah. So, um, where mistakes are concerned, I think uh, there is no human being who doesn't make mistakes. Hmm. And you do not intentionally make mistakes. Hmm. So, it's okay to make mistakes. That's why pencils have erasers. Oh, what's your name? Thank you, thank you. <laughs> and just when you think, okay, now this is wrong, I learned this from it, I don't want to do this. Life has another lesson for yes, you already. Yes, this is another lesson for you already. This is another lesson for you So I don't know, it just, the journey just continues. Yeah. Uh, yeah. Also, you know, human beings have this habit also. At least I have it and I'm sure a lot of people do. It is not intentional. <laughs> you do not want to make a mistake, okay? Yeah. And you don't know that it is a mistake. But when things are projected as wrong, yeah. you want to get away and wriggle out by saying it was a mistake. So yeah. a lot of times, one sure. it's human tendency. You really can't do anything. Mm -hmm. But nobody really wants to do it. You guys have been known for the chirpiness and innocence and bubbliness uh, throughout 90s and whenever you guys have been working. Uh, what made you adapt or go for a suspense thriller? Because it's a whole shift from what you guys are usually known for. One has done that, uh, yeah. those kinds of roles, lots of them and loved it yeah. and enjoyed it. and. It became almost effortless at that time. We have to do it on the screen. No, and I have to say you're an amazing comic, comic actor. actor. Oh yeah. my yeah. god, I, I just remembered your comedy. Amazing. Anyway, carry on. <laughs> <laughs> but if I did anything really, it was, I must say thanks to the director, the writers. Because it was them, you know, kind of the way they wrote it, the way they told us to enact it. Sometimes the directors were like, uh, like Induji or Fesh and all, he literally acted it for you. Uh -huh. Rajkumar Santoshi ji, excellent actor. You just watch him, you're like, if I can do this, I'm already, it's yeah. already my work is you done. You don't believe that comedy and the sense of timing is also a lot inherent. You mm -hmm. have yeah, it. Yeah, yeah. It is not easy for everybody to get a comic role and do justice. It's not easy it to make them laugh. No, it's, not, it's, very, yeah. it's easy it's to make them cry, yes, but yes. laugh. Mm. I think she has that. Oh, okay. no, 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 and I, sorry, I was a great fan of Sri Devi ji. So, no, no, I mean, of course, no, we are not she was comparing the, here, but she was amazing. amazing. So when she used to do comedy, yeah, and I was yeah, like, yeah. oof, ye hota hai, yeah. ye karo. Yeah. But I think, uh, it, you know, off screen also she has oh. that little thing. Yeah. Like how I feel lighter and I like to do all this. I've seen that part of hers also. She's also got that Joking. smile all the time, yeah. you know. 
but I guess then that's what that is the mold she was trying to break. Yes, Tanu Jaji. That's exactly that is, why I am. Yeah, <laughs> that is why she came and she said, "Do something totally different. This is what I want you to do." Yeah, and uh, somewhere I think maybe it was must have been an adventurous day in my mind, and I said, "Acha, okay, chalo, yeah. dekhte." <laughs> yes. Kya hoga? <laughs> what about you, Aisha, ma'am? Same. I mean, I think uh, the person who can really answer is her because. How did she think of us in a different mold? You know, yeah. because हम तो हम भी सोचेंगे हमारा USP है that sweet. आज भी लोग कहते हैं girl next door, yeah. sweet smile, yeah. innocent. Yeah. You know, so these are not bad tags. Yeah. They have actually made us live a life there yeah. for so yeah. many years. They're lovely tags, and with that age, these tags went very well. Yeah. But as you grow, you also want to grow. as an actor you want to explore your potentials mm. and if you have somebody and you are lucky mm. to you know understand the true true potential of you as an actor and give you mm. something else to experiment you know there's a speculation that this is somewhere inspired by big little lies <laughs> is this somewhere <laughs> around that or inspired it from that show in any way not in any way Okay. Uh, the only uh, common thing might be that there are women, uh, you know, as protagonists in that as well as in this. Mm. But the, the, which I've been doing long before Big Little Lies was ever made. Uh, just the number of protagonists is more in this. But I've been working from the start of my career, uh, making female protagonist films. Yeah, you know? that's in my my that's my calling. I love it, and I yeah. want to do it all the time. So no, it has nothing to do with that at all. When you guys were like working and gave us some iconic films in the nineties, uh, how do you think times have changed now when you work on set? What is the difference that you guys <laughs> see from before versus now? There are a lot of changes that I personally feel. Uh, I mean, see, this goes without saying. There are vanity vans, and there is this, and there is that. That's fine. That's mm -hmm. you know, uh, but. I don't know. I mean, the the best change that I actually found was the camera on your face, <laughs> the expressions taken, the time given to yeah. perform, yeah. and the refreshing change uh, is OTT because I think uh, it's really making us break boundaries. Yeah. get out of our comfort zone taking risks i mm. always say that mm. it's a challenge that you have to take and mm. excel because they're giving you an opportunity to do that yeah. so i think that's quite a change for me and uh, because this is an ott show and uh, if you compare it to films do you feel like while doing a show maybe you get some more time with your character to spend with it to understand it better even in terms of directing writing whatever uh, you just kind of get into the skin of it much more than you would in a film yes and of course length has a lot to do uh, with 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 this luxury yeah because uh, definitely one can uh, explore uh, certain shades of the character which yeah. you really would have to just skip over and go to the next scene in in a in a film yeah. you know uh, so 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 that that is and actually that's why also people love you're so invested in the show or uh, in any series that you love because you've really gotten to know them up close back then i remember doing four five shifts in one day and you know four four hours here three hours here two hours here pulled and pushed everywhere doing your makeup in the car because yeah. you have to reach another set with a different look I've done all of that, and you know, um, somewhere that time we didn't realize properly. I didn't realize that, mm. but I realize it now that it's not about the quantity of work that you do; mm. it's about the quality of work that you do. And uh, after doing this, I realized that you do have to invest into your emotions, your work, yourself, and have faith in the director, and you know. surrender and try to do the best mm. because you're getting time here yeah i remember say during yes boss and when we would be working with aziz ji and all and um made the film and all and then they show us a preview just mm. the cast and all see it what did you think of the film and we come out and say agar wo scene kahan hai wo itna acha cute scene tha ye to nahi nahi we have to cut it out yeah because length itni hai so you, the so the uh, as is used to say that the poetry in the film 
that is the first thing that gets sacrificed because yeah. you have to stay with the story yeah. so th- th- we used to sh- shoot a lot of cute moments and mm. sweet soft moments something something nice some lovely moments but those were the ones which had to go mm. because uh, 2 hour 10 minutes 2 hour 20 minutes was then getting too long, too long. and they didn't want anything to drop but now yeah. like you said up to now it's about if you have poetry you do that also yeah you know if it's woven well it just you can keep flowing with the character yeah. um yes uh, so i had read somewhere about raj kapoor ji where he had written that scene nahi scenery honi chahiye so ab hum scenery dikha pa rahe hain yeah and um, lastly before i let you guys go uh, dream mama i have a question for you so hmm. recently um, on coffee with karan kiara advani said that you know um, <laughs> Just to help her, uh, sort of, um, because you all are family friends, and now seeing her, because you know her closely, yes, seeing her so yes, well, yes. you've been so close to Shah sir, and now Sahana is going to be making her debut. <laughs> What do you have to say when you see all these uh, kids growing up and like yeah. you know, the change in front of you? My gosh! So, uh, so like say with Kiara, um, when we were kids, so her father, me, like we were all building friends. Oh. So we chased each other, playing catch and cook and uh, <laughs> lagdi tang and all that stuff. And then you know you grow up, and then you see him dating uh, <laughs> Kiara's mom, and then he gets married, and then uh, Kiara comes along, and all that. So I've seen her, you know, in different stages than growing. Up. Of course, we then moved out from the building, and everybody went their own way. But that little thing of, you know, we've been. Childhood yeah, friends, so you know. That way. bond is different. Yeah. That bond is different. So I've seen her then, and then of course when she was first beginning her movies, so she would ask me, you know, what should I do and all. Ah, oh. uh, and I was like, just go down south, just do all your <laughs> practice over there, and then meanwhile, you know, roles would come here. Then she was like, nee, 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 I'll wait, I'll wait. <laughs> Finally, she did go down south because I think that's a great training ground. Yeah. It's a great training ground. Anyway, and then now, of course, then. So Hana and all have also grown up in front of us. It's a uh, it's amazing to see them because not just so Hana, so many of them say. When I first shot with uh, David Ji, Swarg and all, they were kids. Yeah. Mm. Varun, Varun, yeah. and uh, I think now they all became you know movie stars. <laughs> uh, so yeah, it's it's just wonderful and to see how talented they are and how. All of them work really work hard. Yeah. You know, none yeah. of them takes it lightly that yeah. I'm a star kid and yeah, I'll just arrive on the sets and things will happen. Yeah. Uh, a lot of them really, really work hard at it. Right. So it's beautiful, and uh, I can never say one is my favorite or the other. Yeah. <laughs> All these kids I've seen somewhere or the other growing up into cinema. But that's actually very fascinating, and <laughs> I wish I could like know more. <laughs> But uh, thank you so much. It's amazing talking to you all, and super warm. And I wish you guys all the very best for the show. Thank, thank you. you. Thank you.